What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Guys, we're going to one of the latest Perseverance photos. This is of Sol 92, which came out approximately two days ago. And we're going to have a closer look at this photo because I'm not sure to make it this thing. I'm going to show you the background, which is the mountains. And then I'm going to show you some things on the ground. I'm going to let you guys be the judge of this. And you guys can let me know as always, right? All right. Without further ado, let's jump right into this, shall we? All right, right here you can see Mars Perseverance, Sol 92 left navigation cam, or the nav cam, right? NASA's Mars Perseverance rover acquired this image using its onboard left navigation cam, or nav cam. The camera is located high on the rover's mask and aids in driving. This image was acquired on May 24, 2021, Sol 92, at the local mean solar time of 15 hours and 3 minutes and 19 seconds. And, of course, image credit goes to NASA, JPL, and Caltech. Now... I'm going to show you this photo. You can download it right here. You can see it right there. It's a 1296 by 968, and it's a PNG. Right off the bat, look at the sky, guys. And we know it's a black and white, but I, I, I almost promise you it's probably a, an RGB. But anyway, we're seeing it as a black and white or black and gray and white uh, format. And, folks, let's just zoom into this, shall we? Look at this. Look at the dots in this photo. To me, these are put there just like the grid pattern, right? They're being put there to hide details, fine details. And by doing that, it kind of throws your eyes off. Just have a look as we look down here. It distorts everything. Like even in this blur area right here in the very center, it's in a horizontal area right here, very center. You can see the dots like prominent, like really, really sticking out, right? Now these hills here, I'm not sure what to make of this. Now, if you look carefully, you can see what looks like shapes in this hillside. So in other words, is there something on this so-called hillside that's the same shape of this, and they just kind of went around it and then put the texture on it to block it out. I don't know what the deal is. And then if you drop back, you can see like the ground here. It's pretty good, you know, and then it looks like waviness in this sand off here in the background. Is it waviness? Well, if you look here, I'm going to put it right here in the middle of the photo. You can see right here the whole center from left to right, there's weird little things on there. And they appear to be on platforms, which is very strange. We're going to see that in depth as well. All right. Let's not waste any more time. Let's jump right into Photoshop. Here is the photo. And again, look at these dots, man. That is just crazy. Look at that. What? It, it messes with the eyes. Now, you can see the actual blurring going on here. You can see this area right here. Right here. You can see what looks like it has some kind of decent detail. And what I mean by that is we back out. And it appears that way. But look everywhere else around it, it's completely blurred out. How do I know that? Well, let's do this. Check out this area down here that's also been blurred out. Look at this. Yeah, it's pretty plain, guys. You can see that, right? And again, we got those nice dots in there. So what I did was I started to bring this stuff out. I started going for these mountains first. And we're going to get into this so much more right now. Okay, let's do the first step. First thing I did, guys, I'll tell you exactly how I did this. Go to Image, Adjustments, go down to Equalize. And this is what you end up with. You can put a little blur into it, get rid of some of the graininess and dots like that there. And you can just zoom in, right? Notice how you can start to see this weird shaped object right here. Okay. It appears like everything is like going this way on this mountain, or is it? Because when I say that, there's something also on here that looks like a platform doing this. And it looks like there's one right behind it. Now, let's get into this more and more, because we're going to go right into this. Okay, I'm going to go right to the background here. We'll have a better look. We'll keep going. Okay, we're starting to see these things starting to come out, and the weird crap on the hill here. Guys, I don't know whether, again, they're putting patterns on here. Like, let's say there was something that looked like it was this shape here. And what they do is they outlined it to block it out. I don't think that's the case, but it makes a little sense. But check this out. Look on the back here. Right here. We got something else that looks like it's doing this. Okay. And then we got these other odd shapes. Now, also check this out. We have these lines here. Okay. I don't believe nature does this. Okay. We got something way over here. 
like that and these other shapes in here now let's keep going now check this stuff out okay moving a little bit more what are we seeing here again observe the lines here i don't believe mother nature is going to do this okay we can see other faint lines inside here there's something actually doing this you can see it going like this okay but again the shapes here we got these other pieces on the top here something tells me they block something out of these hillsides i mean it, it simply doesn't make sense the way this thing is laid out and you can see like these little weird like shapes and intricate parts in there i'm not sure what to make of that again i don't know and again we're going to just back up just a hair bit so you guys can check this out look at it with your magnifiers and again i'm not going to really be specific because i'm not sure what to make of this i want to let you guys decide what you believe it is here Something right there has these white dots. You guys see that? There's like one, two, three, four, kind of looks like. All right. Now, let me show you this middle part right here, which I told you in the beginning. We're going to check this out. Again, is this nothing more than just ripples in the sand? Or is it more than that? Because I'm seeing what looks like something doing this. I'm seeing another straight line here. But it appears to be doing this, and it appears to be something over the top of it. And almost looks like it has a shadow. Now, you can't see that now, but you will. Let's get into this. Okay. When I started to bring this out slowly, okay, I could still see it. But this is the first step I took. Check this out. Notice how on these flat surfaces, there appears to be things on here. Is it possible that these are intelligently made, no matter what they are? Now... I do actually try to get rid of the little dots, bring out the areas a lot better, and this is what I come up with. I don't know what's going on here. When you look at these things, I'm just going to bring them back just a hair bit. Again, use your magnifiers. When I look at that, I see this because of the dots. It's messing with the detail, so it's hard to see that. Now, when I started bringing it out, okay, they just happen to be there. Now, we can just say, well, no, there's nothing more than just flat ledges, meaning it's just natural, and these are just rocks, assorted rocks laying on there. But again, like I said, when I looked at this, and this one here is the one that really does it for me, right here, appears to be doing this, going down, and look right here, it's coming out of here, going like this, like this, and then back down. Now, if you notice right here, I'm going to draw this little line, it appears to be a shadow because of this piece here, overhanging this piece now also take note of these other pieces here 90 degree angles and you can see like they all appear to be like levels and they're completely straight guys now keep in mind we also have a bunch of blurring up here but have a look at this right here just peeking out of there Appears to have this darker area right here. But check this stuff out. It looks like there's something right here doing this. And there's something just inside that you can see very, very faintly. It almost looks like these things, whatever they are, are placed here. Notice how you have this, what looks like this darker, like little mini dome type thing. I'm not sure what to make of that. But then you can see all these little things like standing around it. Now I see this object right here and I see these little squares. What is up with that? And look how even they are, right? And I believe whatever that is, is actually goes into this area as well, but because they blurred this completely out. Notice how we got this right here. I told you this top piece overhanging, it actually goes in there. You can just see the white inside here. See that? So something's being hidden here, guys, big time. And you can see the right there, the blur goes right over this stuff just like that. I believe, and if you look back, you can see the rest of the white pieces in behind this blur. See that? Yeah, something's in here being hidden, guys. You can see it. But whatever these things are, they, they look like they were put there for a purpose. And again, I'm looking at what looks like a, an overhang, this piece right here, casting that shadow right inside here over this one here. Notice how it comes right here in the back and comes out. See that? 
what is the chances of that? And you have these other objects doing this as well. You can see just the very edge of this right here. Right? And this one here, I don't even know what to make of this. But this thing comes up, goes around, goes like this here. And you can see these multiple looks like arch type things. It's something sticking out of them. I don't know, guys. I can't make out what these things are, but it looks like it was intelligently put there. Notice this rock here as well. I'm not sure what to make of that, but check that thing out. What is going on there? In fact, I'm not sure if any of these are rocks. Have a look at the way they did this. It looks like they put like this white paint or something over this. Notice this rocks, this so-called rocks doing this, right? But look at where the white starts right here. And it's just over the top of it. See that? Kind of weird, right? See that? Got like a little overhang of this rock, supposed rock, coming down. But this starts here. See that? Either way, we got this other rock back here. It looks like it's got a square built into it, whatever that is. Yeah, I don't believe these are rocks at all. But you guys, tell me what you think. Like I said, folks, I was going to leave this up to you. I wasn't really going to tell you what I thought these things were because I want to get your thoughts. I don't want to be blamed for staring somebody the wrong way. I like to do this every now and then and get your thoughts on it. We could see manipulation, there's no doubt. We see spot blurring, as usual. We got dots all over this photo. And to me, that's to mess with your eyesight and take away the smallest details of whatever's laying on this ground. And of course, you guys can give me your comments. Maybe I'm wrong about this. Maybe you guys have a different idea. Let me know. Anyway, guys, drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think. I'd be curious to see what you see and what you have to say about it. And don't forget to like and share. Always appreciate it. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so YouTube will share it. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell on the right hand side. And when that drop down box comes down, don't forget to hit all so you'll be notified of all new videos. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace, guys.